We turn now to some late breaking news out of Washington this morning and an any ask any retailer recovering from the kickoff to the holiday season and they might tell you consumers are ready to shop. But could ongoing talks about the nation's finances be turning consumer confidence into concern? The conference board released its latest report just minutes ago. KITV4's Hallie Jackson joins us live from Washington with the latest. Good morning, Hallie. Hi, Mahe. What's that phrase? Hot off the presses? We got it right here. The consumer confidence level is up to 73.7, the highest level in four years. So this means that folks really are feeling good about the economy, feeling better than last month, feeling better really than they have all year long. Now, it's not consistent with a healthy economy just yet. We'd like to see a level of 90 for that to happen. But the dark shadow kind of hovering over all of this, negotiations over the fiscal cliff. The White House is warning that high consumers are feeling may soon tumble lower if there's no agreement on how to avoid tax hikes and across-the-board spending cuts by the end of the year. A new report from the White House shows that people may spend $200 billion less next year if the president and lawmakers don't work out some kind of a compromise. And, Mahaya, time is running out for them to do that. The president and Congress have to get their act together by December 31st. But, again, the big story right now, at least the headline at this moment, consumer confidence is up. People are feeling better about the economy, better about jobs right now. Well, I certainly felt good about it. I went shopping this weekend. Did you? Look at you. I did a little <laughs> bit. Got the Christmas presents for the nieces. Yeah, so I'm part of that, that Black Friday holiday shopping group. Oh, yeah. It was crazy here. Uh, one more question, Hallie. How are negotiations going on between lawmakers and the White House? Over the fiscal cliff, right. So staffers are working kind of behind the scenes here. We know the president spoke on the phone over the weekend with congressional leaders, but no face-to-face -face meetings set up with the White House at this point. However, the president is meeting with, for example, small business leaders about the fiscal cliff. He's headed to Philadelphia at the end of the week to talk about this more. So you'll definitely see it as a headline over the next, what, five weeks here, Mejia. All right, Hallie, thank you so much for joining us live from Washington, D.C. Also